Hello everyone. First of all, on behalf of Team 4, I want to thank you all for taking a few moments to view our presentation. My name is Sean Castle, and presenting with me will be Quinn Eddy, Ryan Schwab, and Sarah Bondog. We are very excited about our solution and the benefits it provides, and we hope that after hearing our presentation, you all will be too. And with that, let's jump right in. This scenario may look familiar for those of us who have played golf before, but for those of you who haven't, I can go ahead and set the scene for you. It's a beautiful day outside. You arrive at your favorite golf course, ready to conquer it like Tiger Woods, or a different professional golfer if you don't like Tiger. But first, we have to check in, pay for our round, and while we're at it, we'll go ahead and purchase a new box of golf balls just in case. Now we're ready to head out onto the course and start playing. Although once we're on the tee box, we remember that we aren't a professional golfer. Far from it, actually. And even with the 10 practice swings prior, we still slice our tee shot pretty badly. And unfortunately, no one in our group was paying any attention. So no one saw where it went, or at least can confidently say that they saw where it went. And we end up in the situation that you see right here trudging through the trees and the rough and hopefully finding our golf ball in, in a timely manner. And this has become a more common scene on the golf course than it should be, which is usually followed by this one here. The frustrated players that are stacked up on the tee box behind you, wondering what exactly you're doing out there. Why haven't you hit your second shot yet? And if you look back, odds are you're going to see a lot of angry gestures telling you to pick up the pace. So you take a deep breath, realize you've only lost one ball so far today, you drop another one, and you keep playing. This problem happens to a significant amount of people, as more than one million golf balls are lost each year due to varying circumstances. And for many of us, we often spend longer than the USGA approved time limit of three minutes looking for those wayward shots. I know that I'm guilty of this from time to time. I mean, let's be honest, it takes a little bit longer than three minutes often to find a ball in the rough. And that's when we identified our high potential opportunity. The GPS tracked golf ball. A solution to a problem that many people are struggling with and are tired of the hassle of looking and looking and still not being able to find their golf ball. A moment of struggle that was 94% of PICFU survey respondents say is more than enough to motivate them to make a switch. But the problem is, there's not a solution currently on the marketplace that allows that. Until now. Our high quality product will rival the top performance golf balls currently on the market and will allow golfers to accurately track where each shot goes by pairing it with our state of the art smartphone app. That way you know where each shot goes every time, even if you or somebody in your group didn't see it. We want every golfer to be able to spend more time playing and less time searching by using this app enhanced technology to track your development, the course itself, and most important of all, where your shot goes. Now I'm gonna pass it over to Quinn and he's gonna talk about our key resources partners, and activities that will make this solution possible. Thanks, Sean. Jumping into key resources, brand name recognition is a major advantage TaylorMade has that will ease the introduction of this product. As one of the top golf equipment manufacturers, the TaylorMade name carries a degree of credibility while providing differentiation. TaylorMade has a reputation known for innovative products sold at competitive prices that deliver game improvements for players of all skill levels. Another key resource is TaylorMade's production facilities. TaylorMade has two dedicated golf ball manufacturing plants in the United States and one newly acquired in South Korea. Production quality is of utmost importance at these facilities. Having multiple manufacturing locations gives TaylorMade the advantageous ability to scale up production in the event of a demand increase. 
Wide scale production capabilities will be key to ensuring that the product will be on the shelf when the customer needs it. Currently, Nassau already produces traditional tailor-made balls along with Costco's Kirkland Signature brand. Utilizing their production expertise, TaylorMade can ensure that quality will be consistent. Nassau's three plants, including facilities in South Korea, will also provide a platform for TaylorMade to achieve the large-scale production required for the product to succeed. Having offshore manufacturing will help keep production costs low and provide additional cost savings during the assembly process. These savings will be passed along to the customer where they will gain value from both a cost and quality perspective. Another key partner essential to the production of the TaylorMade GPS golf ball is golf technology pioneer Arcos. By combining the capabilities of artificial intelligence and automatic shot tracking, Arcos already established processes will provide consumers with the highest quality GPS experience available on the market today. Leveraging this relationship will allow TaylorMade to be the first to market with a fully functioning mobile app that encompasses both the user interface and the user experience. Their proprietary innovations will provide differentiation from the competitors that will inevitably attempt to enter the market in the near future. Having Arcos technology already in place gives TaylorMade a tremendous boost from a research and development perspective. Removing the need to invest in R&D yields a cost savings that can be passed on to the end customer. This allows the TaylorMade product to compete directly with high-end traditional golf balls. The app itself is a huge selling point of this product. Available on both Android and iOS platforms, it is easy to use and intuitive. Ensuring that consumers have easy access to the GPS track golf ball will be paramount if TaylorMade is to maximize sales. Having been in business since 1979, TaylorMade's vast and well-established distribution network is itself a substantial competitive advantage. E-commerce in conjunction with major retailers and course pro shops will result in value to the consumer from an ease of purchase standpoint. There are quite a few channels that will be utilized to offer the TaylorMade GPS golf ball to buyers. A major focus will be e-commerce and our online retail partners. This avenue will be key for stimulating growth and boosting revenue. We will of course also offer consumers with the ability to purchase direct through the TaylorMade website. Along with golf course pro shops, traditional brick and mortar will be utilized. Our product will be available at all major retailers, including Golfsmith, Golf Galaxy, Dick's Sporting Goods, and Academy Sports. At this point in time, the next best solution in existence was the Encore Genius Ball. I use the word was because it's now discontinued. Most of our competition will stem from traditional premium golf balls, including the Titleist Pro V1 and other top tier products from Callaway and Bridgestone. Lower tier products such as Top Flight will also yield stiff competition. Thank you, Quinn. My name is Ryan Schwab. I'll be speaking on solution utility golf ball price, our respondents survey, and our ecosystem blueprint. So the concept of utility value in the case of our GPS golf ball is how instrumental the device is to achieving the goals that the consumer has put in place. The main goal of our GPS enabled golf ball is simple. It's to cut down on lost balls, which cuts down on overall costs for golfers, decreasing round times, by decreasing the amount of time it takes to look for a ball. And both of these will increase the pace of play. Track important metrics. Golfers are interested in, in metrics like ball speed, club head speed, launch angle, et cetera. And today golfers can get those metrics with our app. We compared our golf ball against the Titleist Pro V1, which is a tremendous ball. I've golfed the Pro V1 for many years. It's the number one ball in golf. And while they have many great features, they do not have the capability to do GPS tracking. The second option that we compared our ball with is Top Flight. Top Flight is a much cheaper ball. And it also does not have the GPS abilities that our ball does.
When conducting our conjoint study, we found that the number of consumers who want a GPS-enabled golf ball outweighed those who did not. And this tells us that no matter what the allegiance customers have to the top ball brands of today is, such as Bridgestone, Callaway, or Titleist, that they would switch to a product, our product, with the GPS-enabled tracking device. Simply put, the value and benefits one gets with the gen, our gen, GPS-enabled ball, golf ball far outweigh the alternatives. One of the big value adds that our solution has is the ability to track your ball using an application. The smartphone app is free. There's no subscription required for basic app use that will give every golfer that uses the ball GPS tracking ability. For additional features that track the metrics that I mentioned, subscriptions will be available at a price. So the value advantage in, that we're creating with our product is for golfers to pay a little more initially for these GPS features, but save money in the end by not losing so many balls. Looking at attributes, the key attribute between the three options that we showed respondents was price point. Additionally, GPS technology and durability were also very important. It's interesting to note that brand and manufacturing sustainability was not as important. Price point being the most important attribute followed by GPS and durability. In addition, respondents indicated that the following were the most important in order when assessing the value. Price point, GPS technology, durability, golf metrics, sustainable manufacturing, and brand. Again, we believe that golf enthusiasts would be open to paying more. If it means they're actually saving money in the end because they're not losing as many balls, we think that they would do this. Nothing can mess a great, up a great day on the golf course with friends, family, and clients than losing a ball. I'm an avid golfer and, and would be pay, willing to pay more to avoid the hassle associated with an errant shot. Losing a ball on the course can be extremely annoying and upsetting, not only for yourself, but for those you're golfing with, those behind you that are getting backed up, and the course marshal. When looking at the first simulation that we did, we compared our ball with Tylus Pro V1. The results indicated that our solution scored more favorably than that of the number one ball in golf, namely Titleist. And this is a huge win for us. Like I said, Tylus is the number one golf ball brand today. It's the number one ball on the PGA Tour. And to have our solutions sc score more favorably than Titleist shows the value and the gap in the market that we're fulfilling. With Market Simulation 2, we tested our ball against a much cheaper alternative in top flight. It's worth noting, as I'd mentioned earlier, Top Flight does not have GPS capabilities either. The second simulation I find fascinating. While price is very important, customers were willing to pay more for the GPS features that we have. And in looking at this simulation, you'll note that our price is almost three times as much as a Top Flight dozen balls. So this shows that while price is important, the value we bring is worth spending the extra money. Key findings included uh, durability factor were not surprising. So our ball will last at least seven rounds while top flight is less than half at three. Looking at the ecosystem blueprint, what we need for this to be successful is an ecosystem that works well together and has a good synergy and good partners. And TaylorMade has a unique and specialized set of partners, producers, suppliers, distributors, et cetera, that all have their roles to play and all complement one another. 
the TaylorMade team has done a super job of creating rock solid relationships in their network, consisting of from before we get raw materials until the end users using the ball. So starting at raw materials, we see the biggest risk in procurement of these raw materials, chips, rubber, urethane. We put a yellow on those as those have more volatility in coming to the manufacturing site on time. Once we're at our manufacturing partners, we see little risk. Once we get to the, our distributors, however, there is risk that we had valued at yellow. Due to the shortages that COVID, um, container shortages, supply chain, workforce sh shortages have shown the last few years, but that's getting better and we'll put this only at a yellow. Once our ball makes it to our brick and mortar, golf pro shop and e-commerce partners, we see no risk in getting it to the end customer. My colleague, Sarah, will now talk about social responsibility. Thank you. Let's switch gears and take a look at how our product in partnership with TaylorMade will build social value and responsibility. Our goal is to use the power of golf and sport to drive three key initiatives in an effort to give back to communities around the world. Our first social value initiative will be focused on serving underprivileged youth. By creating programs in partnership with professional golfers, golf courses, and clubs, we can offer enrichment programs for free or at a reduced cost. This initiative will provide children who may not have been exposed to golf in the past the opportunity to learn how to play and develop skills to continue their growth. These enrichment programs will be designed to help build character and confidence in children that can be leveraged in other aspects of their lives outside of just sport. In addition to the enrichment programs, we will also want to take steps in becoming a more sustainable and environmentally responsible company. This will come from making improvements not only to our tailor-made facilities, but also setting annual reduction targets for our partners Arcos and Nassau that we mentioned earlier. These improvements will include reducing both the amount of waste produced by the facilities as well as a reduction in the water consumption used for the production of our golf balls. Our final initiative will be centered around providing fair wages to everyone involved in the production and manufacturing of our golf balls. This program will include guaranteed minimum wage and overtime pay, as well as ensuring working conditions meet standards set by TaylorMade. Our goal is to make certain that all employees that work in our facilities and our partners facilities worldwide are given what they need to live comfortable and fulfilling lives. If we now take a look at some of the marketing channels we will use for our new GPS golf ball, you might notice that a lot of these same channels are already used today by TaylorMade. The goal with our marketing is to be where golfers already go and be visible in platforms that they are already using. The first of which is to offer demos and user testing right on the course. By offering demo days, we can get our new golf balls in the hands of our target market. We will have trained professionals from TaylorMade walk the players through how to use the ball, how to track the ball from the GPS locator app, and how to tap into all of the great metrics available from our app subscription. This shows the true value of the product used in a real life scenario. We believe that these demos will be a critical tactic in displaying the benefits of our solution and how it performs compared to other non-GPS golf balls. In addition to these live events, we will also tap into more traditional marketing channels such as television commercials and magazine advertising. We will seek magazines targeted to golfers and sports enthusiasts such as Golf Digest and Sports Illustrated. We will place our television ads on sports networks including ESPN and also televised golf events such as the PGA Tour or the Masters Tournament. Finally, we will look to use social media to drive awareness of our new solution, with our primary focus being on YouTube. There currently are YouTube channels that are already geared towards reviewing sports and golf equipment. 
and these already have millions of viewers monthly that look to them for guidance on what to buy next. By using these channels, we can have trusted experts review our product and compare it with other options. Their endorsement will help promote sales and build trust in our solution. All of these channels in combination with the placement of our product in golf pro shops, retail stores, and online retailers will position us to drive sales in our first year. The brand awareness that TaylorMade already has will help support our new product and build trust with our target consumer. Thank you for tuning in and to learn more about our GPS golf ball solution and how it will help our target consumer save time and money on the course. Thank you.